Hey everybody, it's Matt here, the Toku Dragon. And today we are unboxing and taking a look at everything that comes with the Gosei Sentai Dai Ranger Super Sentai DVD set released by Shout Factory six and a half years ago. I'm gonna repeat that, six and a half. But anyway, on the front here it says, before Power Rangers there was Super Sentai. And you can see the color behind it being a bit of a different color. And what's even weird is the blue on the Die Ranger logo. What I don't think is weird, though, are the uh, using the actual human cast on the front. You want to differentiate the series from Power Rangers. Early on, I think there could be a little bit of confusion, even though those suits were never technically used, other than, of course, the White Ranger suit, which, to be fair, that is on the front cover on the bottom here. But still, I don't think that that's the worst thing. What's interesting, though, is that they actually went for the full title on the front, even the full title on the spot. Fine. Um, they put kind of a white uh, background behind the blue logo, which I do like because they're using a similar background that they did with Z Ranger, and it was so weird that it was just blue on blue and it kind of blended in. Here, interestingly enough, though, like I said, they're using the whole name. And I find that interesting because of the fact that Z Ranger had like a weird font and just had Z Ranger on it. So in this case, they're like, no, we'll use the whole name. We don't just write Die Ranger. But also using a more normal font for the whole thing very very interesting as they're kind of like evolving the way they make uh they, they make these boxes and they you know the certain creative choices that they have on the boxes as they release them on the back here you can see that it's the same tagline but it's not as a bridge as it is on the front and of course you know see where the worldwide phenomenon began with the original japanese series that inspired the power rangers franchise the three tribes of the daos empire shura dai and gorma were peaceful until the Gorma set out to conquer the planet, launching a magical war between the Gorma and the Dai tribes that lasted for centuries. In the end, both civilizations were lost. Until now. The evil Gorma have returned. Now, it's up to Master Kaku to assemble a team of kids with high levels of chi to become the protectors of the Earth, known as the Dai Rangers. It's interesting that they call it a magical war because while it is just that, there's also so much martial arts used during this magical war that it's funny that they're focusing on the magic more than the martial arts. Like, if you didn't know anything about Die Ranger, you'd think that they were just shooting energy beams at each other, which, to be fair, again, they do, but you would think that there would be a lot less kung fu than there actually is, or just general martial arts than there actually is. Now, looking at the disc here, I actually really do enjoy that they're using everyone's um, just human form just in general for these discs. I thought that they were going to transition to actually using the Die Rangers in suit, but funnily enough, they didn't. They just went right back to the drawing board, uh, although going for Ko at the end here for some reason. Um, looking at, you know, everything in the background, it's just the same that it was last time, just telling you, hey, listen, these are what episodes are on what discs, five episodes per disc. So I removed the disc so we can take a better look at the artwork, and I definitely enjoy it so much. It brings up a lot of memories of the series. This is actually one of my favorite Super Sentai. I've seen it entirely, all the way through, uh, uh, totally via this DVD set. And then looking at this, uh, died ends back. All right. And my Tenshin Da. Yeah, yeah so fucking funny what, what a what a funny pose to have up there and then of course the ending theme uh the beginning of the ending theme right there with all of them on their bikes that they totally used all the time like i'm talking about every episode am i right everyone they didn't they didn't use them all the time what a pose but yeah so that is everything you get when you buy gosei sentai die ranger the complete series on dvd by shout factory uh, not a lot in the way of special features or kind of, you know, booklets or anything like that. The movie, sadly, while there is one, it is not in included in this set. Uh, I don't know if it'll ever be released in the U.S. Uh, because of the fact that it's only 20 minutes. So it's very short. It's fun, but it's very short. So I don't think we'll ever really get it. But if we do, maybe it'll be part of some bigger, you know, uh, release or something like that of series. If you're not, or of movies, but if you're not really familiar, uh, it doesn't seem as if if at the time Saban, now Hasbro, has the rights to any of the Super Sentai films. So it doesn't seem like we're getting any of those in the U.S., Like unless, like I said before, they may end up being part of some larger like film package, kind of like how they were released in Japan, more of in a bundle, uh, at least in the more recent uh, versions that they released on Blu-ray. Maybe, or maybe not. 
But either way, you're not really losing much without it. You're getting the whole series right here. So either way, thank you all so much for watching. As always, if you like the video, please remember to like and subscribe. And if you don't like the video, as always, you can still like and subscribe. I won't judge you for it. So love you all. Take care and tune in next time. So I'll see you.